Well, it's that time of the week where we tug on your heartstrings just a little bit by honoring our Oma of the Week. And this week, Charmaine Besser has nominated Opa uh, De Whitney and Oma Dorothy Schwartz as our Opa and Oma of the Week. And it's so great to have them on the line right now. We're going to speak to Charmaine first. Good morning to you, Charmaine. How are you? Morning. Fine, thanks. Yourself? Fantastic. Good to have you with us. Quickly tell us about why you decided to nominate your parents as our Oma and Opa of the Week. So I've got the most amazing mother and father. Mom's 71, dad 78. They've been married, I think, 53 years. They've got a huge family, three daughters and son-in-laws, 10 grandchildren, counting the wives, and then seven great-grandchildren and another one on the way. Wow. And they do so much for all of us. They um, they're involved with the church and the moths, and they always doing good for others before themselves. Oh, absolutely fantastic. We actually have a family picture on our screens right now where we can see both uh, Grandma and uh, Grandpa. Let me speak to Grandma Dorothy quickly. Good morning, Grandma. How are you? I'm fine, thank you, Kasekor. Fantastic. Now, how does it feel to know that you are nominated? You are actually our Oma of the Week. I've actually got bubbles in my stomach. <laughs> <laughs> And uh, of, course, of course, I mean, uh, just like uh, Charmaine just said now, you have a big love for your grandkids and you're very involved in the community, uh, bringing them together. Tell me about your grandkids a little bit. What makes them so extra, extra special to you? The grandkids and grandpas, the grandkids are always special. <laughs> and Grandpa, what do you love so much about uh, spending time with the grandkids? There's always, always, always something to do and keep you on the go all the time. Now, I guess, are they, are they living in Cape Town right now and you up in Joburg? Uh, no, we, uh, we in East London and uh, the grandkids some are here and others are well, there's some overseas. Oh, fantastic. Well, it's great to have to, to actually be part of your family this morning and to honour you as our grandma and grandpa of the week. Thank you so, so much. And Charmaine, is there any last parting words that you'd like to uh, give to your parents? Yes. Um, they, they always taught us to be honest and loyal and to respect others and I can see that coming through in all the grandchildren and great grandchildren. They're trying they're always trying to improve things, but there's one thing they'll never ever improve on and that's being a better mommy and daddy and granny and grandpa than what they are. They're just perfect. Oh, absolutely fantastic. Thank you, Grandpa Whitney and Grandma Dorothy. You are our Oma and Opa of the Week, and for that, you get spoiled with a lovely Oma Rusk hamper, and I hope that you enjoyed. That's the perfect way that you can use to spoil your grandparents. Now, of course, if you'd like to spoil your grandparents and nominate them, you can do so by sending that nomination over to Oma at ExpressoShow.com. Right now, time for us to go over to the kitchen. It's all about gourmet, gourmet brying this morning, and you and are standing by with some lovely, delicious dishes. Love your Oma, Dipper Oma. Oma of the Week is brought to you by Oma Rusks.